Hello everyone, this is Chandani with WeDharma.com. It's been an interesting couple of weeks. Not the kind of couple of weeks that we go through every couple of weeks. It's been a couple of weeks since my father passed. And extraordinarily enough, um, it's uh, hit me in a way that one could never conceive. In that I've actually been quite okay about it, meaning that I've continued with my life and you know, seeing that I am really immersed in like the yoga world and the path of consciousness and trying to become a more expanded person in my life, I've um, not really gone through kind of like the classic mourning process, which um, I believe a lot of people go through like it's totally normal. But over the past couple of days, I did find myself um, sort of quite snappy and in quite a rotten mood. And I owe that to um, maybe uh, the grieving process. So it's been interesting to sort of observe myself um, as I reflect back on these past two weeks and how um, the departure of someone so integrated into one's life can affect your overall experience. And what I've um, come to uh, want to share this evening is that, um, you know, how we always say that life is in the moment and life is about experiencing the now. Well, it hasn't been emphasized more to me uh, or I haven't felt it more than I have in these past two weeks. And, um, really the uh, essence of what we feel and what we have and what we experienced at any given moment is the deepest and most important part of our existence. I really do stand for this like I've never stood before and to really be as present as possible and to envision life and experience it from a place of totality is really something that we can practice again and again and again. Um, we just got back from the amazing Bhakti Fest festival that's held annually in Joshua Tree, California around this month of September. and. Um, if you don't know about it, please go to bhaktifest.com and, and find out for next year's program. But it was a gathering of musicians and yoga people and seekers and lovers of life and um, from all over the country and, and probably even internationally. Um, but it was just a gathering of people that came to celebrate together um, in the name of divinity in the name of peace and the main name of unity and and um, it couldn't have been a better timing for me because <laughs> I really needed a, a laugh in the sunshine and that's exactly what it was and just to be around old friends and new friends and understand that really it's just about jumping up and down and having a laugh and we need to take care of the things we need to care of and we need to heal the planet and we need to better humanity but really at the end of the day if we can't come together as a group as a community and have a laugh and just lose ourselves in some music and some poetry and some natural setting then really we've missed the boat so um in honour of my father's departure and his commencement into the hereafter, whatever that may be, I celebrate. I celebrate his life, I celebrate our life, I celebrate life, I celebrate humanity and I am so happy that we together at WeDharma.com and out there in the great wide world can say be here now, be here now, for if you are not here now, then when? This is Chandani with WeDharma.com. Have a great, great rest of your life.